Hey y'all, and you're welcome to my vlog. My name is Erin, and this is another bonus video because my wonderful critique partner, Kat Rector, who lives in Belgium right now, sent me some more treats. It is slightly partially open because Snow tried to tear it open, so I peeked a little bit, but I haven't tried any of the things, and I don't actually know what all is in here. So we got our little note. Dearest Erin, may these treats find you in good health. First, many sea salt caramel Tony bars. Those are the Tony's Choco Lonelies that I opened in the last video. They were so delicious, so I asked for more. And a pile of Ruby Kit Kats, which I also asked for more. I've also included Peggle, otherwise known as Mouse Shit. They come in milk chocolate, dark chocolate, and fruit flavor. Try them on toast with butter or on ice cream. There's also Speculoos cookies and a supper thing. A bag of spice is for a famous Belgian dish called Dovlas and is a slow cook beef dish in gravy. I've translated the instructions, but hit me up for help serve with fries, and go num num num. Toodles, cat. Like, why are you so cute all the time, cat? These are, oh God. One of them opened, one of them opened. There's chocolate all over the inside of this package. These are the three flavors. We got the fruit, dark, and milk chocolate. I think they got a little bit crushed in shipment, which is why one of them decided to open. There are multiple little boxes of them. So many little boxes of them. Oh God, another one opened. They're so crushed. Oh my goodness, I get so many copies of everything. These are the Speculoos cookies, the Jules Destroopers. So just a different variety from last time. Last time was the waffle cookies and I guess these are the Speculoos, which are fucking delicious. Oh my God, they're like four packs, three packs. There's three packs of the Kit Kat Ruby, which if you did not watch the last video, it's a new variety of chocolate. It has like a little bit of a berry-ish aftertaste and they're freaking amazing. And then we got a whole bunch of the little Tony's Choco Lonelies. These are the sea salt caramel variety. So they have these very delicious little caramel salty chips in them and it's glorious. If you don't feel like watching the last video, I will just show you what these chocolate bars look like because they're really cool. They have this really neat design on them. So it makes it a little bit difficult to eat, but they look really cute. So I got five of those. Thank you, cat. Oh my God, there's more Speculoos cookies. <laughs> so there are, oh God, there's eight Speculoos cookies in this package. <laughs> And then here is the spice pack for the traditional Belgian beef dish. And then she sent me English instructions because I don't speak Dutch. So I'm going to, now that we've gotten all out of the package, I'm going to try some of the ones that I did not try in the last video. So I'm just going to make a quick bread and butter and we'll try all three flavors. Alrighty, so we got our triple flavor bread. So I have the milk, the fruit, and the dark chocolate. Start with the dark chocolate. No, I never thought I would like sprinkles on bread, but this is pretty good. I don't even like dark chocolate. But it's nice. It doesn't really have too much of the bitterness of a regular dark chocolate fruit. I have no idea what fruit flavor it's supposed to be. You know, it just says fruit sprinkles. It does have like a general fruity kind of flavor, but it's mostly just sugar. It has a very different texture from the chocolate varieties. I don't know if you can see, but they are a lot rougher on the outside like they don't have that shiny outside coating and the milk chocolate look here there's peoples i think i might actually like the dark chocolate one the best it has like a really good balance of flavors the milk chocolate again is just chocolate flavored sugar which it's a sprinkle so i don't know why i was expecting anything else i'm not going to make this recipe right now because i don't have any of the ingredients all right, and then the other one to sample that I did not get to try in the last video is the Speculoos cookies. I did have Speculoos tea last time, so I already know what Speculoos tastes like because it's amazing. Here is the very, very cute Speculoos cookie. They have a lot of similar flavors to like a masala chai. It's very, very similar to like a ginger snap, but almost like a more gentle flavor in comparison. Oh my God, they're so good. I'm gonna eat these with all of my tea. <laughs> It's a cookie. <laughs> no, you can't have it. You may only sniff. Thank you so much to Kat for sending me some of these delicious treats. So that's all I've got for you today. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you'd like to be notified as soon as I upload, then ring that bell. 
All my social media links will be in the description below. Both of my books, Olympian Confessions, Hades and Persephone, and Olympian Confessions, Hera, are available now in ebook and paperback. If you would like your manuscript critiqued by me, you can check out my new critique service on my website. If you've enjoyed my content, consider being part of my Patreon family, and I will see you all next week with another video. Bye! Thank you.